Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Mass Effect. Uh, we just have a couple things to finish up, and then we'll just basically be done. Um, so I do gotta go, I gotta go talk to people. I'm not live streaming right now. Um, this is just me doing my thing, trying to make the game not crash. Uh, where are you? Oh yeah, we're on bold. Get an order to Kahele. All right, we're on bold. I want to talk to her. Pleasure to meet you, Pathfinder. Priya Blake, Captain of Outpost Teravuni. I'm glad you're here. I thought we'd have to deal with this on our own. What's the problem? Is it the cat? No. At least I don't think so. A few of my drill technicians went missing on a research expedition west of here. We've tried their comms, but get nothing but static. Do you know where they were headed? I know the route, but we lost their tracking signal halfway through. I don't know how far they got. So they're between halfway and farthest. Notes, but the data is corrupted. We have zero leads. Oh. I was supposed to That's keep these odd. people safe. I've already failed them. Don't lose hope. I'll find your people. Coming from you, I believe it. Uh -huh. The research log is in the lab. Maybe your AI can piece together the corrupted data and get a nav point. Hmm. I have to say, I'm surprised the Angara let us put an outpost here. A portion of the ice we mine goes to their blockade runners, who take it to resistance bases all over the cluster. Oh. Water for their soldiers. It feels good to do our part against the Ket, however small. That's a good idea. We're staking a claim, but what does the initiative want with Vold? Look at the landscape. What do you see? Ice. A lot of ice. Water. Vold is a massive, endless source of it. We're proud to serve as the initiative's first ice runners. We mine the ice here and haul it to colonies where water is scarce. Like That's a good else. idea. Even the Nexus. The more people we wake from cryo, the more resources we'll need. Our ice runners make sure water is never a problem. I like that. You picked a mouthful of a name for the outpost. Meh. It's Shalesh, Angaran language, means forward together. Ooh, nice. It represents the close relationship we have with the Angara here on Vold. Glad to hear you're working together. This is their world. Because of you, they trusted us enough to give us a place in it. Now it's my job to cement that bond. We'll do our best to earn what they've given us. I like it. Whoops, you nope. picked him. It rep this. Now it's my job to cement that bond. We'll do our. Were you in the Alliance too? I was an Alliance officer for a decade before I got sick of being a pawn in the Council's power plays. Nice. Heard about the initiative and figured it'd be a fresh start. Chance to make a real difference. You ever miss the Alliance? Given the chance, I'd make this choice all over again. But when I see the resistance push against the cat, makes me wonder if my days behind a gun aren't really over. Mm -hmm. I should head out. Come back if you need anything. I mean, yeah, settling uh, hostile worlds is never an easy task. Okay. Hi. I got one for you. So yeah, I get to meet the oh, power crap. Power responsible for making minutes. this place happen. I'm Lizanna Telesso. Because of you, I have the best job in the galaxy. Your armor is so cool. Which is... I'm an ice runner. I get to dodge the scourge and outrun the cat to bring water to the colonies. Doesn't Her get more exciting cool than too. that. Facing danger to make everyone's life better. No wonder you love it. When you put it that way. Your job isn't too different. Oh, you know. So you mine the ice as a water source. Smart. I fly ice blocks to the Nexus. Eos even made a run to Havarl for the Angara. Speaking of which, it sounded like there was trouble brewing when I landed. In Angara Havarl? on edge. Maybe you should check it out. Okay. How did you get into this job? I was a pilot for the Citadel fleet until I got bored and wanted something new. The initiative sounded right up my alley. I was one of the first to sign up. But how do you end up at this outpost? I asked. Marched Meh. into Priya's office and told her I was the best pilot she'd get. Said I didn't care if the outpost was mostly ex-alliance. I wanted in. I've been giving her trouble ever since. Nice. I've flown through the Scourge before. It's not easy. That's half the fun. I get to change my routes to avoid it. Like I'm outsmarting it. I've had a few close calls where it shorted my nav system. Once, I flew blind all the way to the Nexus. That's a present. There's no way you pulled that off. There's a reason I was the Citadel's best pilot. Take it easy. 
No fun in that. Yeah. All right, let's see if we can get out. Rider. Wow, this is really cool looking. Like, I mean, with the like Aurora now and everything, it's so cool. It looks really nice. Like, wow. We still have that kid thing. I mostly, at this point, I just want to get the main stuff done. Like I said before. I think right now I'm actually going to focus on movie night. I'm detecting below normal temperatures. I don't, I don't actually know. Actually, no. I'm going to talk to everybody on the ship. And that might help progress movie night? I'm not sure. I don't know. But I have a couple other games I'd like to play. Joel's been asking to talk to you. Excellent. Okay, hang on. Let's just let's just have a chat with everybody. Where to next? I'm not sure. Honestly, I'm surprised I still have a job. I should probably just retire. <laughs> <laughs> Don't be silly. We still need you. There's so many outposts that need support. Then let's head out there. Sounds like a brilliant plan. Woo! Let's just run through and check with everyone. What can I do for you? Uh, nope. Okay, we're good. I'll let you concentrate. You know where I'll be. Okay, so I know for sure. Jal and Lexi were wanting to talk to me. Meridian was mind blowing, right? I mean, someone didn't bring me where the real action was, uh -huh. but I heard you were amazing. No safety net, no Sam. Didn't bat an eyelash. <laughs> Eyelashes were the only thing I wasn't batting. Batted the Archon right out of the park. Now, Helios will really take shape, and we have VIP tickets. You're In some right. ways, I feel like our adventure is just beginning. I like Thanks that. for chatting. We'll talk again later. You know it. Bye, Park. Okay. Yeah, let's just stay on the same floor for now. No one has any. It looks like most people don't have anything. Scott's back on his feet. Hovering around. No way near ready for the field. Is he here? How much will get done with two riders? Oh my I gosh. I can't wait to see Ephra's face when he learns there's another one. <laughs> I have a dream. Tev Uni. A home in Vold. Sort of. Still feels good, though. I'm glad. We'll talk later. I know it. Okay, then. Cora. Meridian, at last. There's still so much to do. For the Nexus, the Angara, but not today. Today, we get to feel good about winning. Heck yeah. See you later, Cora. I'll be here. I actually bought the, uh, the Bioware's having that huge sale right now. And I bought the, uh, the casual rider, like, loungewear shirt. Not this, but, like, the thing that kind of, like, Cora's wearing. I bought one of those. Uh, did you get my message? Uh, I didn't read I my email. Exciting news. And I wanted to tell you in person. Should I sit down? Meh. Is that another idiom? Or... Yes, of course. Do what you like. Meh. Yeah, it's an idiom that means... Never mind. I've been offered an advancement in the Resistance. Oh, wow. And... My own command. Uh, okay. That makes complete sense. Congratulations. Thank you. My family is very proud. And so am I. So, when did this happen? Recently. You know that I wasn't satisfied with my position and direction in the Resistance. Or life. True. Very true. Yes. After my successes with you, they see me with new eyes. But more importantly, so do I. So you get your own command? It's a covert squad. Tech Ops. 
Oh, nice. Commanding a small group of elite specialists that infiltrate advanced kept sites. High danger, high reward. I'm not gonna, like, keep him here, but, you know, I, I don't know. That's a hard choice to make. I won't stand in your way. <clears throat> That's kind. It was a hard choice. Okay, then. Should we head back to Aya? <laughs> what? Why? Are you serious? I'm not taking the position. But that's crazy. It's what you've wanted. What I wanted, yes. But not what I needed. Huh, okay. Not what I need. With your help, ah. I broke free of expectation. I found my better self. The, the lip syncing seems like it's a little off. My gosh. That's one of the nicest things anyone has said to me. Seriously. Good. Seriously. No, really. <laughs> You've changed too, I think. More open, like a true Angara. Thank you. Perfect. <laughs> oh. You're stuck with me now. <laughs> At least until this all plays out. Besides, you need me. We do. Don't push your luck. <laughs> but luck can't be pushed. <laughs> it comes to us in... Ah. Idiom. Those are the yep. last things you Shit. learn in any language. <laughs> hey, hey, nice! He, like, stomps off. He's like... Bah, bah, bah. Um... Okay, let's go down. Well, actually, we'll just go this way. We'll just go... We'll just make a loop. Drac and Detra. A toast to the vanquished. Yeah. The Archon, face down, ass up. <laughs> How about to Meridian? To dreams and family. To whatever's next, may it be beyond our imagination. It's my toast, and it's to <laughs> the vanquished. <laughs> you hear that? <laughs> Hail the Archon Killer. You know. I heard it was touch and go, but you really rose to the occasion. I got lucky, 100%. Better to be lucky than good, right? Forget that. Leave nothing to luck. Good talking to you, Gil. Good plan. Anytime. Good plan. That was a good win. I wonder what other kind of trouble we can get <laughs> Always looking for the next fight, aren't you, old man? Gotta admit, old habits die hard. I might have had a long time to settle in. We can I talk more it. later. I love it. Sure. Drax's my favorite. He's my favorite. And then I'll drop down. I swear I got the parts from Aya for the movie. Woke up today and thought back to the search. And then I remembered it's over. It's really over. We did it. I know what you mean. I don't want this high to go away. I'm going to enjoy for as long as it lasts before I settle down. Settle down? No. Yeah. Now that we're back on track, I thought I'd maybe talk to a Nexus colonization expert. Get assigned to an outpost, start a farm or something. <laughs> Who am I kidding? Yeah. I love being on the ship. I'm staying here until you kick me off. Good, because you, yeah, you scared me for a you second. You probably have work to do. We can chat later. You know where to find me. I think... It should be everyone back here. We just got... What? Lexi. Ready for more tests? What? Not again. Lexi, I'm fine. Sit now, and I'll skip the blood work. Have you experienced any muscle spasms? Nosebleeds? Memory loss? I feel like my normal self. You haven't been normal since Habitat 7. Inhale. Yeah. <sighs> Exhale. <sighs> you should know. Professor Hirick approached me about a transfer to the Nexus. Oh! Apparently my research on Ket anatomy has been useful to the militia.
Guess I'll be telling my next doctor about my abandonment issues. <laughs> I declined. Really? Didn't have a choice. No other doctor in the initiative would take you. <laughs> oh, I'm thank lucky you. to have you here. Yes, you are. But I'm pretty lucky too. I'm glad she likes being here. Uh Ryder. I saw another memory that dad locked away. The day my mom died. I'm sorry, Ryder. Even in her last moments, Dad couldn't accept Mom's death. It's hard to let go of the ones we love. If you can't run from it, use it. Guess that's what he did. Hmm. I guess. I'll let you get back to it. I'll be here if you need me. So I can't remember. I've got a walkthrough. Uh, we have to buy some Asari liquor on the Nexus. And so I don't know if we've done that. And apparently after we give Lexi the booze, she'll point us to Liam. And then we have to go to Kadara to get a better movie, apparently. So let's run to the Nexus. Well, actually, let's check in on Sam real quick. Mapajig! I guess you prefer the Tempest to Meridian. Works for me. Got an adorable tail. Let's check the emails, I guess. Oh boy. Uh, attaches a vintage watercolor style painting of the Tempest grounded on Meridian with Callow posing heroically. Uh, <laughs> that's awesome. Uh, we're not done, Buster. There was a galaxy secret hat there. You gotta go. So, lap up the praise, but do it quick and get back in gear, Buster. Hmm. The things I wrote as we walked away from Meridian Control. This is the best night I've ever felt. Gosh dang, the Hyperion hit hard, but it's home now. Holy crap, all these people are home now. I'm gonna walk this whole sphere. Wonder if there's fish. Can we make fish? We brought fish. What's in this star? I think I'm gonna cry and it's great. Tomorrow would be great. Let's go exploring. Liam, I'd love to go exploring. They want to name a gun after me. I might do one for every... This is Vetra. I might do one for everyone on the Pathfinder's crew. Are you trying to be funny? Nix that! <laughs> Uh, from Subi. I thought you'd like to know the science team has decided to name our first Helios Milky Way plant hybrid after you. It's not exactly viable yet. About 90% of them die shortly after germination. And those that survive tend to be sterile, but we're getting there. Okay, just read this over. I feel like it could almost be taken as an insult, but I swear it's not. From Jal. Hope that one day changes coming for the Angar and the humans are lucky to have each other. That's what Ephra said. No, really, he did. From Cora. Good work. Just the right person for the job. All right. Sam? Hello, writer. Through Meridian, I gained insight into the Jardan, creators of the Remnant and the Angara. Meridian's code accounts for incredible potential and infinite diversity. They weren't achieved. No creator would be content. You think the Jardan might come back? Unknown. They abandoned a great work, which you have reinterpreted. Against significant odds, you are home. Hmm. Thanks. But what's a Pathfinder without their Sam? Two halves of a whole. In a brief time, you have suffered, triumphed, and grown. You are a new iteration of yourself. Respected and recognized. I have lived it with you. I see why the unknown beckons. What it means to prevail against it. This is how one's humanity is grown. I am glad to know. Me too. Thanks, Sam. Nothing more. That is so neat. Sam is like Sam is evolving as as well as as well as uh, any human, you know, or humanoid, I guess. All right, Nexus to the well, huge. Writer does lead us to interesting places. Think there's anywhere more interesting than Meridian? If there is, we'll find out. There's gotta be stuff. <coughs> there's gotta be all kinds of stuff Hold everywhere. On a bit steady. We just got pinged by another of those ZK trackers. Did we now? Let's try to get close enough to pull some data. Or, here's another plan. Here's another plan. We could just go to the Nexus and buy some hooch. And bring it back to Lexi. And then go talk to Liam, who will then send us to Kadara. 
Because movie night can't be easy. Gosh dang it. I think that's the last big thing I want to do. I do want to do Drax little like wrestling like a fresher bar or something. I don't know. But then I'll feel a little more free to play another game. Oh, was, it had the pressure maw thing here on the Nexus, too. Well, first we're doing movie night. Sure. Movie night! Da, da, da. It's nice to see the arcs in there. I'm glad they were able to make it. I will always love that ship. It looks so nice. Okay, so the vendor... This is not marked anywhere. Um, general merchant in the back right corner of the docking bay. I don't believe we've bought anything, like, ever from here. I don't think I, I didn't even know this one was over here. Pathfinder. Hi. Hi. Vehicle. No, no. General. Um. Yeah. I just want, you know, stuff. I don't know. Maybe at the bottom, I guess. Or I could've done it that way. Aha! Oh yeah, sure, sell salvage. And... All right. Oh, so I bet you movie night was in, was all, was listed in the Nexus stuff. Then we'll return it. All right, we're getting so close. So close. Where'd she go? Oh, man, I was not ready for that. Oh, wait. Um. Okay. So, back up the ladder we go. I'm really curious if um, Reyes is gonna be there. At the movie night, just swing by. I mean, we're going to Kadar, might as well pick him up. No excuses. Ah! It took too long. One bottle of acantha, barely opened. Barely? It's medicinal, you understand. Cuts down hangovers, which will save PB and Drax some grief. Of course. Of course. Thank you, Ryder. Would you ask Liam when we're doing this? I've got a couple of things to finish up. I'll let you get back to it. I'll be here if you need me. Liam! Whoosh. I say, let's enjoy a few movies. And everyone else says, oh, <laughs> let's have an extravaganza with all the trimmings. All right! <laughs> You're complaining? No. Well, maybe, because now I need to do it all justice. You got me a decent library, but I heard someone has a director's cut of Last of the Legion, the band version, remastered, no crappy extras added for the Hannah. And you want me to look? <laughs> It'd be the gold dusted cherry on your Sunday. In the meantime, I'll get things set. We're more than ready for a night in. Yeah, it's true. After all we've been through. All right, Kadar. I mean, I mean, even if you didn't tell me to go to Kadara, now that I know what kind of movie it is. A hundred percent the only place you'd find it is on Kadara. Although maybe Vetra could find it on Kadara more than I could. Maybe Helios Flora is more edible now. No, With don't do it. Active. Not again. Mm-hmm. I've seen reports of floral mare stems and plants that didn't have them before. This could be it. If you do try them, make sure it's not before a long shift this time. 
<laughs> the guy was like, I can't stop you, but don't make me suffer. <laughs> that was funny. Okay, it's on this, this floor. That's good. I mean, I guess all of Kadar is pretty shady, but I was kind of assuming we'd go to the lower levels where it's extra shady. I really love the design of Kadara. Like, the, the port here, it's so cool looking. I really like it. Hi. Don't mind the dirt. Um, oh, oh! Special edition OSD, The Last of the Legion. Critically panned upon its release, but popular on Turian military bases. Blasto 8? The Biotic Awakens? That's the wrong cover? Oh, we did it. Just for you, Liam. Wait, no, we just, yeah. What am I doing? I don't know, who knows? Oh god, I can't remember. What's a door and what isn't a door? We're nearly there. Oh my gosh, I can't I can't even I can't even process that we're nearly done with that. I'm so excited! And the resistance. The fight goes on. We have to secure Kitasira and other territories. There are still questions. But Jardan may be the only ones with the answers. Not the answers we determine for ourselves. Mm hmm. Hell yeah. Meh. <laughs> I did it! Last of the Legion. This is what you wanted, right? Wait, you actually found it. That version's practically a myth. I'll tell everyone to grab food. Jarl and Gil said they can rig something up in your quarters. Oh, if my you room? Clean up, no problem. Just hit the console when you're good to go. Call the crew together in my quarters. I'm so excited! If we didn't pick up Rez while we're like, it, while we were in Kadar, I'm gonna be so mad. Uh, my room. Here we go. Here we go. They need you, Jorax. I know you left the Legion. I never left the Legion. Left me. <laughs> but I know my duty. Look, everyone's so right, like folks, chill. We a training montage with what many critics describe as excessive Turian flexing. No such thing. They're really. <laughs> They're really. Or we can fast forward to a ship crashing into an asteroid, crashing into a moon. Fast forward to the crash. Ah, oh, montage. Don't cut bits off. I'd go for the yeah. Forwarding to the action scene. Going once. Going twice. Skip to the good stuff, Liam. Boo. What? You gotta have the build-up! No! But it's a vacuum. The ship explosion would be silent. <laughs> uh, that's not the voice of experience talking. Guess they wanted their money's worth. They actually blew up a derelict for that shot. Too bad the script wasn't caught in the blast. <laughs> My strike team will hit the enemy cruiser, General. Force is the only thing fanatics understand. <laughs> My strike team, torpedo the cruiser. That's overkill. Get one engineer aboard, cut life support and engines, problem solved. And leave them stuck on a hostile ship? One torpedo, over by lunch. <laughs> I just seduced the enemy! I think a charm offensive might be more rewarding. <laughs> yes. Classic irresistible hero, pretend to be captured. Beat up armor, enticing scars, and soulful eyes. Yeah. <laughs> so flies. Dinner is <laughs> show off my villainy. They get cozy. And then strike. Or not. <laughs> Why spoil the evening? <laughs> it's very Angara. Enough. Time for another round. Anyone for a Baron's jaw? Or a euphemistically delicious? Wait. Lesson. <clears throat> no. Oh, wait. Just kidding. 
Rats. No! No! Ugh, he was a sidekick. They die like goldfish. No acting like Ogre. Even Ryder could do better. If I wanted to. <laughs> what? What? Oh, really? Come on, show us. I'll be dead for you. <laughs> oh, that was a painful smile for sure. <sighs> it isn't fair. He was so young and so, 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 so much to give. Ah, <laughs> oh, writer. I can't feel my. I can't feel my gallbladder. Uh, <laughs> do you even have a gallbladder? Oh no, <laughs> it's worse than I. <laughs> The slow, dramatic death. Oh my gosh! No. Damn you! Damn you all! <laughs> what the heck? When did this turn into charades? <laughs> Their smiles look fine. Let's stick with the overacting Turian. Yeah, please put the movie back up. Don't make me do that again. I swear. Oh, Jorax, so many years ago, <laughs> we were so foolish. Our hearts are one. No enemy fleet, no sea of stars can oh, ever this is so us cute. <laughs> Phoebe's like, I can't keep my eyes, I can't keep my eyes open. Oh, look at John and Suvi are like the mom and dad. They're like, oh, precious children. That was so fun. Oh my gosh, I'm glad we did that. I am like, I'm a bit peeved that the Reyes romance didn't do anything, but it is what it is, I guess. But now that movie night is done, I do want to do... He wants to play again. The rest of these, I'm not worried about. But we w definitely want to finish up whatever Drac wants us to do. This might be an extra long no, one or split in two. Not sure. Movie night. Now, after that movie night, I gotta go take Drac out. He was kind enough to sit through the movie and even, you know, fall asleep. But now we gotta go wrestle some Thresher Miles. We'll play a game about wrestling thresher moths because there's no thresher moths on the nexus as far as i'm aware which you know who knows <laughs> trying to have better posture when i play games it's easier with the controller because you can kind of sit back but with like a mouse and keyboard you gotta like hunch over them or at least it's easier to I'm interested if this is gonna be like a card game or like a board game or like a VR game. Who knows? I recently just played, started playing Hearthstone for just kicks. I saw somebody live streaming it and I was like, I've seen lots of people play. And I was finally like, I'll give it a go because it's free, so I might as well try it, you know? It's pretty relaxing to play, honestly. One of the few games I play that I actually would be like, you know, doesn't require a whole lot of like energy expenditure, is pretty relaxing. Okay, hang on. Sorry for the frames, they're terrible. Where? Oh yeah, the vortex is the, is the I think it's the only bar on the ship, right? What is this, like 20 frames? I'm appalled. This game looks so dang good. I'm just really sad that my computer can't play it properly. Like, without the frame drops and stuff. I apologize for my inferior PC. Hello, my favorite friend. 
The others aren't here yet, but it shouldn't be long. The others? Meh! <laughs> Cash and Vorn. If we're gonna teach you Krogan games, we're gonna need more Krogan. Vorn doesn't bug you as much as you pretend he does, huh? Yeah, don't tell anyone. Aww. He's smart, real handy with plans, kept the colony alive and going after we left the Nexus. Cash made a good choice there. Not that I had any say in the matter. So, oh, fire-breathing Thresher Maws of Doom? Ah, that's right. Pretty basic game. First one Krogan kids usually play. I've seen vids, and I know Thresher Maws are damn huge. But, fire-breathing Thresher Maws of Doom? That sounds like overkill. You'll see. It's great. Right, This so better be like a card rules. game or something. Kids game, remember? It's simple. Burn down all the other pieces on the map. You win. Wait, burn down as an actual fire? Yeah, it's a good question. Metaphorical fire. <laughs> what do you say? Oh my god. Mini flamethrowers. Mini flamethrowers! <laughs> well, at least the table is fireproof. I think. Hey Dutch. Yeah, just don't hit the drinks. Bartender will have a fit. Yeah, that's yeah, 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 that's very true. Um, now what? Where'd he go? No, now I'm confused. Oh, did we, I mean, did we already do it? Is that, is that it? Just, we don't actually get to play? It's just pretend? I just pretend learned a Krogan game with mini flamethrowers and didn't get to play it? Uh, okay, it's the thought that counts, right? <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, that was easy, I guess. So that's basically everything I wanted, everything I really wanted to get done on this game. Um, so, yeah. <laughs> Sorry to kind of end it on a less than uh, crescendo note. I don't know. <laughs> kind of seems like a bit of a an appropriate metaphor but you know we won't go there <laughs> but no i really did enjoy this game and i'm looking forward to eventually you know finishing up all the side quests and stuff but at this point i'm just happy to have all the main stuff done and i'll probably move on um i did get a playstation 4 a long time ago and haven't been able to play any of it because i'm catching up on games um but i really want to start playing horizon zero dawn uh really badly um there's tons of games i could be playing i know um that people want me to play and stuff and if you want to see me play more variety of games you can hop over on my twitch and i do play several kinds of games over there just for funsies um but yeah i guess this is sort of the official ending of this series so thank you guys so much for supporting me in playing this game especially through all the technical problems we had through like a good chunk of like the middle section like you guys are amazing, and you're super supportive, and a lot of you at least comment, like, at least on some videos, if not all of them, and I really have appreciated it, um, and I've enjoyed the game, and I, I, I probably will, like, live stream maybe some of it, like, just doing some of the side stuff, but it's really nice to just have all the main stuff done, and, and I'm glad. I'm glad it exists. It's a good game. Overall, it's a good game. It has its quirks and problems, but I like it. I wish I, legit wish I had a better computer to play it on. Um, but yeah, so thank you guys very much for joining me. This feels weird. This feels really weird to, like, end it. If, if any other videos come up, they'll be, like, side, side quest things, you know? But I guess this is sort of the official ending, so thank you guys again. I sincerely appreciate it, and I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did, and I will see you in the next series.